Oh, my mic was muted. That was great. Well, anyway, everyone, welcome to the stream. And welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. And the Spaced Out DLC. We, uh, last time we, last time we did this was Tuesday, and we came here to this early beta to see, uh, what was new. And, hey, Teasy Girl, yeah, here I am. Hey, Teasy Girl, welcome. Um, and while we didn't make it to any of the other, uh, asteroids or get to try out the, the abilities to travel between the asteroids just yet, we did start on a new asteroid because we were forced to, but we were lo it was locked in. Uh, we did start on a new asteroid that had a new starting biome, the Swamp Biome. So, um, we at least get to try out some of the new stuff there with the, um, with the, the, the new ways of producing oxygen and dealing with all the polluted oxygen that the game is now making us deal with at the beginning, which, which was new and interesting. Uh, that's that's for sure. Uh, it was it was definitely a different kind of challenge than you normally get at the beginning of Oxygen Not Included. So uh, now there's too much oxygen, too much of the wrong kind of oxygen included. Uh, so anyway, so um, I as I mentioned on the last stream when we were playing Age of Empires, I do have a second game going, a test game going, and um, it would crash on me every time I got to a certain point. Well, they must have updated between then and now because it's all of a sudden uh, magically let me continue. I tried it out again last night just to see. And it let me continue. So hopefully what, that whatever was causing that crash uh, has been fixed and we can now not have to worry about dealing with that particular crash, at least, in this game. Let's go ahead and uh, jump into, into the cesspool here. And so today I want to uh, finish our dig to the uh, the teleporters here and, uh, tra and and teleport ourselves to the uh, new or the second asteroid and we'll need to pick a couple of candidates out for who wants to go but I think we need to also bring in some more uh, duplicates first because uh, once they go uh, at least in my test game they don't get to come back anytime soon so we kind of need to be aware of that and be um, be sure that we want them to go before we send them along. So let's actually unpause and we'll bring in a uh, printable here. Uh, let's take somebody, well, let's, let's, we could get somebody who has some generic, kind of everything type of skills. Um, do we need a dedicated cook? Because other than the flagellant part, that one's a really good cook. Uh, let's look at the skills here. Actually, we do. Let's take that cook. Uh, there we are. Blueprint. Yeah, we'll take Ren. Uh, yep, that'll be good. Okay, we'll take Ren. And we're digging over here, and we're almost there now. And actually, we're going to have to dig across here a little bit. Uh, actually, that'll be okay. Well, I'll put a ladder in anyway. Build across there. So anyway, so we'll get down here and get this get this moving um, pretty quickly here, I hope. I also want to, yeah, you want to, well, I mean, you want to send somebody who, you don't, definitely don't want to send somebody who can't build or dig, that's for sure. You want to send somebody who's kind of a universal, um, or who can at least do a little bit of everything. Oh, speaking of which, uh, Jake, you have another um, skill point we can spend. Eris has another skill point we can spend. And Ren has his initial skill point, which we can also spend. And we'll give him the grilling skill. And that means we need to come out here and also do the priorities for Ren to be cooking. Oops, there we go. And who's complaining about what? Breathability. Shocking. Shocking that we would have breathability problems. So one of the things I want to do, potentially even before we leave, although we don't have anybody who can do it, we do have Ashcan ready to go for ranching. Do we have... Did we get the research done? We did. Is Ashcan skilled appropriately for it? And, yes, because Ashcan got to jump right in there. Because Ashcan came with the skill. That's right. So before we leave, I definitely want to wrangle those uh, plug slugs and get them moving. If, uh, TZ Girl, if you're interested in being Ashcan or Ren, I, I can... Uh, 
rename one of them to you to be Teasy Girl. It's up to you, or if you want to wait. Uh, I think both Ashcan and Ren are at least ostensibly the male gender, so um Whoa. Freak out on the computer. Hold on. I just had my computer just went haywire on me. Um the image that I have that shows the uh genders of the duplicants. I hope you guys can still hear me. Um because my computer just had a freak out. It it's very large and it likes to hog a bunch of memory. Um so yeah. Okay, good. And it just it just stopped the freak out, so it's it's good to go now. Okay. Anyways, um so if you're interested in that teasy girl, uh let's see. Can't see with the hats on is easily, but I think Yeah, Ren is definitely the male gender. Yeah, I think they both are. So, can leave that open. But uh, we also can, if anyone else is, is watching and would like to, to chat a bit, we can definitely uh, assign a duplicate to you as well. Um, so I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to build a room. Because, well, oops. Except that I don't know that that's exactly where I want it. I need to check. Because we don't have this planned out entirely yet. 16 is there, so this is where the wall goes, right here. And we need to move that ladder over. That's right, I remember now. We also need to, at some point, deal with all this soup. Actually, I think we can dig this whole thing across. Did I get any germs down here, or is this still germ-free? It is still surprisingly germ-free. And I want to try and keep it that way. Um, we'll dump the polluted, the germy polluted water someplace else. Good, that one's sleeping plugged in. At least we'll get a little bit of battery charge out of it. So this needs to go all the way until somebody pees in it. Doggone it. Ash can. Well, so much for that idea. Didn't last long. <laughs> okay. Great. So my idea was to put a, uh, a room in this area here that is a polluted water tank. And this will be a stable for plug slugs. So let's go ahead and uh, prep some stuff. I don't need to do that. We'll just destroy that stuff. Uh, let's see. We want to do a... Or do I want it to be out? Yeah, I'm going to make it out here, actually. Um, yeah, because... Actually, go ahead. Go ahead, make it cheaply to start with, and then do it later. Actually, I'm going to take this out, and we'll go ahead and plan for that uh, fire pole as well. We talked about the last time. Take that out. Is there fluid water in there? There is, but we should build them up, those three little blobs up, I think. I shouldn't have built that uh, airflow tile there just yet. Don't get yourself stuck, Eris. <laughs> so we have out here the warp pipes... And those are useful for transporting items back and forth between the two the two asteroids. So that makes life easy to begin with, so that we can do 
we can actually explore two different worlds at the same time. Which is nice that they give you that option at the beginning. I'm assuming that's... Hopefully, I'm, I'm hoping that's going to be a permanent feature. But I honestly don't know. Um, let's take... No, let's not take that out. I will wait. No. Alright. If I'd have been paying a little bit more attention, I might have caught it where I could mop some of it. But it'll dribble down, and that'll be fine. Because if there's, if there's too much to mop, there's enough to run off. Kind of how it works. And then we want to do, let's see, a uh, food. Critter drop off. Put that there. Critter feeder. That can go there. A grooming station. Somewhere here in the middle, maybe. And then we just want some decorations of some kind. Uh, we can do some of this stuff. Good, it's granite. I can't remember if I had switched that to granite or not. Can we, we mop this junk yet? Yes, we can. Get to cracking. Okay, so what do plug slugs eat? That's the question. Plug slugs eat raw ore. And they fart hydrogen. So we need to fill this with uh, ore. Metal ore. Oh wait, we go to plug slug, right. Plug slug, cobalt ore is all we have, so that's what we're going to feed them. It's night time. We can also prep this room a little bit more. Uh, because we can have... Oh, I don't... I can't have these. I forgot. I, I learned this in my test game, so you'll have to bear with me on it a little bit. But what we want here is some wires. And these are the wires, of course, that the slugs will plug themselves into because they're plug slugs. And this technically makes the room ugly because these are like minus five, but you have to have them bare somehow. So I just do it like that. Seems to work out well enough. much liquid there, though. We'll pick up that water at some point. Probably don't need this too high wall over here anymore. It'll probably be a little bit shorter. Alright, so now we can deliver... Uh, we only want to have six in here. I think that's the limit for this size room for them. And we can allow plug slugs and plug sluglets. And then we want to have uh, capture. And let's just wrangle whatever ones we have, which I think is only two. So far. I mean, there's, there's two more captured in here. But uh, we'll let them out once we wrangle the two that we have available to us. And uh, Ashcan should go and do that. There he goes. So they kind of wrangle them just like you wrangle the... Um, oh, what are they called? And they kind of remind you a little bit, too, of the... Uh, wow, I can't remember the name of the critters. The ones you shave. Whatever they're called. Okay, and we have, and they're being nice. Okay, let's, I'm going to give them a little bit of priority here. Yeah, the Drekos. Thank you, TC. <laughs> oh, jeez. Gotta love brain damage. All right. Especially when you don't have it. How badly is, are the germs spreading in here? Eh. Could be worse.
Go ahead and build a wall here. While we're waiting on stuff to happen. Uh, they haven't really started storing much yet either. We need more dupes. That's really the big issue. That is mud. I'm also going to want to start making water uh, available here pretty soon. Actually, that whole wire can go. Any other crazy wires I have someplace? Don't think so. Nope. Alright, so these guys should be starting to get tamed. Yep, their wildness is decreasing. Slowly. Always need more dupes. Yeah, until you don't have any food to feed them. Which I'm going to have to set up pretty soon. Especially since we just got a world-class cook and I'm not even making... I don't even have them making anything. Let's do... Uh, let's build those stations, I guess. At least temporarily. Um, do the microbe musher. Although, I, don't, I hope I don't have to use it. And we'll do the electric grill. We'll just do them temporarily here for now. And then I'll probably maybe move them down into here. Because we have, or should have, some stuff we can cook, I think. We also need to start some farming. Who do we have that's doing farming? Anybody? No. <laughs> okay, we need a, we need a, somebody to specialize in agriculture, too. We should also build some farm tiles and start growing some of those bog bucket things. I think that's what they were called. I could be making that up as well. But actually, I need to get this tank finished before I can do that, because I have reasons. Reasons are good to have. So I think we can come in here in the next cycle and free these. Means we can also get those. I'll go ahead and uh, set the wrangle up for those too. And then once we break our way into there, then we can wrangle them. Uh, this probably wasn't the best idea of a, of a location here because that's exactly where the ladder is going to be. Let's go over here a bit more. Even though this is just temporary, I don't want it to be that temporary. Because the ladder needs to go... 16, right? Yep. It needs to go here. Let's actually take these two out and make a big old mess. Well, look at the floor panels there, I guess. Or f blocks. And then uh, we can move the ladder over by one space. One tile off. And let's uh, sweep this stuff up relatively fast. Get him. Dig that out. Make a little bit more room for this polluted water down here. Once we can get that then. Okay, I see it there. Why is it not letting me click on it? There it is. Polluted water. Cancel sweeping. Because we're not dumping polluted water yet. Although we kind of could now that I don't have to distinguish between both the good stuff and the bad stuff. Did we get the... No, I didn't research it yet, the fire pole. It's kind of expensive at this stage of the game anyway to waste that much metal on it when we're kind of limited as to the cobalt we have. 
And there's tiny amounts of copper in this. These by ooh, another critter. That's new. Grub grub. They're related to Sweetles. They look like a worm or a caterpillar or something, whereas the Sweetles are well beetles. Interesting. All right, so we have four. So we could, if we find two more, we could wrangle two more. And we have a printable. Nice. Construction and husbandry. Construction is good. Germ resistance is good. That's okay. That's kind of of a bummer. Machinery and strength. Those are always good. Decrease construction. But that can be regained. Especially with the machinery, you want somebody who, who can do machinery and be able to construct as we as we learn later in the game, unless some of that stuff has changed. This one is completely generic, perhaps too generic. They start with the aesthetic design, which is kind of weird, given that they are uncultured. Uh, I guess... Trivaldo, just because I need somebody to do something. Let's take Trivaldo and let's do um, carrying. Because we need somebody to start doing some, some cleanup work. And then we'll do priorities for Trivaldo of those three and single tick priorities. Actually, yeah, we're going to mop those up. Whether it's Laying uh, or open, or if it's bottled, it still off gases polluted oxygen, as far as I can tell. Yeah, it still does. So, either way, it works. Uh, let's do. Where's that at? Uh, refining? Yes, the sludge press. We haven't built one of these yet here. Uh, but these are kind of. Uh, these are one of the new buildings, and they're kind of fun. So, what this does is it takes in. A sludge, whether that's uh, mud or go that way, um, polluted mud, and it converts it into its constituent components. So mud becomes dirt and water, and polluted mud becomes polluted dirt and polluted water. So you can, if you if you're careful, you can set this up to. Um, make the sludge into dirt and water or polluted dirt, polluted water. And that helps with your science research. And that helps with other things as well. So, I thought we might have enough No, because we haven't gotten to the grub fridge yet. Where? Oh, we don't have the, the bog jelly yet. Right, right, right. We could probably come in here and, and access these guys, although the problem with Sweetles is you have to feed them sulfur in order for them to produce sucrose. So sulfur's not rare, but is all the way over here is all over here and it's just, um just a dig to get there. Although there's some right here, so it's not that bad. We could set up a ranch for them too. Short story long. Uh, should I do some decoration in this room? I probably should. Uh, let's do just some flower pots, maybe. Like that. We'll put some flowers or plants or something in there. Holy crap, there's so much polluted water. I may have to make this polluted water tank even bigger than I normally do. Till we can deal with it. Um, let's also do some prep. Yeah, prutify the slug nursery. Let's put some uh, f hydroponic farms here. Yes, hydroponic farms. Take that out too. Or not yet. No, not yet. Um, and I think we can go ahead and set this up. Let's see, this needs to be 
Round about here. Now let's put a ladder in first. Let's put that ladder in before we forget about it. That'll go right about here. And then we need pipe to come out this way. And go up and into here. Oh, too far. Too far. And then wire, of course, to follow that reverse path down to there. Because the bog buckets require polluted water irrigation. And instead of making the dupes carry it, since it's so readily accessible, we had six. So let's go there. Uh, we'll just pump it in there. Plus, that'll help consume some of it as we uh, get in here and start using it. Which is always useful. Yes, I know. There are no crap... Crop... Craps. There are no crops planted. And they're going to irrigate anyway with what they have. But we'll... Um, we'll get the... We'll get the irrigation tiles going. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, Mellow Mallows. Bliss Burst. I think they're... I think these are 10 to 30. Those are 20 to 50. What's our temp like here? Warm. All right, good. Do that then. And then we'll maybe do the bliss burst here, kind of in the middle. And then we'll do there. There's a lot more... It seems like there's a lot more ice biomes on this... Um, on this asteroid as well. Compared to... Uh, these... Everything but the rhyme, uh, but rhyme at least. Ready to go? Pump it up. There we go. Okay, so now we are irrigating. And we have 0.67 bug bucket seeds. Oh, is that so? Okay. Put some more of these in over here. And then these will come down. This will eventually be a wall. Oops. I'll fix it. Ah, uh, we can cook some fish now. I'm always iffy on it. It's plus three morale, so I don't know if I want to do that <laughs> this early. Where are the grub fruits at? Ah, here they are. Colony achievement earned. It's not raw. Have a duplicate to eat any cooked meal prepared at an electric grill or gas range. That would be that one omelet that we made. Probably set a high priority on these, that way they get done timely. As slow as you can, Jake. Take your time. Ah, uh, there's that 0.87 mellow mellow seed there. Uh, we can take one of these out, but I want to. No, I don't want to do that. 
Doggone it. Well, I'm going to have to do this at some point, so I might as well, I guess. Time is what you take best. Nice. Go ahead and pick up those as well, since they are edible. Do we get more bug bucket seeds now? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know how you can have a fraction of a seed, but somehow it's possible. All right, let's put down some more of these. Try and deodorize a little bit more. A little bit more. Yeah, sorry for the hypothermia there, Ashcan. Bubble of natural gas in there. It's my fault for making these igneous uh, insulated tiles, but... I'm going to push all of this polluted uh, water this way. It's expensive to do, or not expensive, but... Not very uh, time effective to do, but it has... Sometimes you have to do things like that. Well, that's an ATN down there. We should probably get to some of these rooms and see what we can find in them. Just so much polluted water. It's kind of ridiculous. Might have to build another tank for it up here. And then we get a cool slush geyser to produce even more polluted water. As if we didn't have enough. Let's fast forward through the night. Probably gonna need some more bathrooms pretty soon. Seven dupes sharing a bathroom, two, two toilets is not ideal. Especially when one of them gets jammed up. Did I not hook wire up here? I did not. Yeah, there's so much so much uh, cold biome, or uh, ice biomes here. This is like three or four of them all chained together. There's one over here at least. Um, I mean, there's plenty of warm biome too, but there's like a sul the new sulfur biomes here. Um, oh, more mess. Well, at least you didn't pee in the pool. Ashcan again, by the way. You notice who's doing all the peeing? I have to have a little bit of a scaffold here, though. I do it like that. Save myself a half a headache. You get a skill point. Can you get a skill point and not peeing all over the place? Um, we should probably do this one. That's also why I'm building an insulated tile wall here, because this cold, we're trying to, I need to try and keep the cold from seeping too much in, although we have heat seeping in, so it's 
not a bad thing. But then we also have all this cold over here, too. So, I'm trying to balance everything out. Go ahead and let them work on that. I'll just build right over it when it's time. Breathe, Jake, breathe. Oh, it's time to do some more of this. That's basically the idea. But I just want to push it out of this so that I can make rooms over here. And have just this whole area here be a big old tank. Printables. Um, let's see. Excavation, strength, and medicine. That's kind of, I don't like all these one one like yeah. Creativity, machinery, cuisine. That's quite the combination. Hi, Hip Lunatic, welcome. See, I don't I don't like this one either. Talk on it. Pretty good, how are you? Give me some dupes I want. Game. Good, 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 good. I think it made it dribbled a little bit of polluted water down there, but hopefully not any of the poison stuff. Nope. Or that's polluted. Infected. That's what it's called. Infected water. Do that. No, let's not do that. Let's do this. And we'll do that as well when we get there. Okay, don't get yourself stuck. Do not get yourself stuck. Hey, Fazian. Welcome. Lurking away. Well, I guess we could potentially pick that before we leave it trapped in there. Maybe we can eat it. No, we don't have too many calories here, but we can always use more. Ooh, we have a spindly grub fruit. What do these take? These take sulfur as well. Dang, what's with all the sulfur? Well, I'd say you deserve it. Playing a game like that. I think I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna put another tank up here. As much as I am loath to do it, um, I think it's necessary. It's just too much polluted water. up here because I want to explore this way because down here by the way uh, this is a granite biome that kind of takes the place of where we would normally have a um, an oil biome so we're not that far from magma here think that'll be okay. Hope. The polluted dirt should hold it. I think maybe I should do a cap around here like this. Just to be safe. Alright, so now I think it's time... I didn't get that. That's alright. I think it's time to take this junk out of here. Also, I should be continuing to build this push better than pumping it out of there, which is what I'm trying to avoid having to do. I 
I actually thought about trying out to Eternal, and then didn't. Uh, I messed up, but that's okay. It'll be fine. Uh, can you dig that out, please? Or is it... No, it's not. Alright, good enough. Good enough. Can't reach that. I hate it when they do that. I actually thought about playing Doom Eternal for a minute. Thought about it. For a minute. But as Data said, to an android, that is an eternity. So. You know. So, they've been hopping on this for a while now. Uh, Ludarx has been doing a good job of that. And, um, built up our water supply a little bit here. Just good. That's going to all fall. It's all mud and polluted mud, but that's okay. I'll deal with it. Hey, Devian. Welcome. What happened over here? Uh, must have melted some of the ice. Yeah. Ice is melting. I think. Must be. Yeah, it must be. Oh, it's probably polluted ice, which melted about minus 20. I'm going to have to build something to get into here, like this. Get most of that built. Got it. Me trapped. Vazian's trapped. Easy in. Quit crying and then go over there and dig your way out. Jeez. Did you, did you hear that little uh, chirp? It was a different chirp. That's the I'm trapped chirp. Get out of there before you get yourself trapped again. Chris is digging like crazy here and turning all kinds of stuff loose. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to build up one another, one more tier higher, because this is gonna get full. Might have to be a three, three sec, three wall section high tank. All right, and then I can dig a little bit of a tunnel here as long as I keep that sedimentary rock over my head; it shouldn't collapse on me. Oh, that's right, you guys are starting ARC on Monday, right? That ought to be uh, interesting. Why does it feel like that's too many spaces? It's not, but it feels like it is. Monday is Conan. Is it Wednesday arc then? Or is it a week from Monday? You guys are playing something different on Wednesdays, right? Well, I am including oxygen. Look at all that oxygen. Uh, nope, nope, that right there. Well, or this here, even. Look at all that oxygen. It's a lot of oxygen. It's all the oxygen. Of course, there's a lot of polluted oxygen, too, but it's all the oxygens. All, all, all of them. All two of them. Look 
Gloomhaven. Yeah. I couldn't remember the name. I keep I keep wanting to stop by and at least say hi and then I get busy and then forget. And then you guys are done. I'm like, oh, they're done. Oh well. Once again, I missed. Surviving the aftermath, I saw uh, when Catherine Sky did like her first series when it first came out, but I haven't looked at it lately. Uh, was it you who said who said I should take a look at it? I can't remember. Someone told me to take a look at it a couple weeks ago, and I still haven't. But then again, I haven't really had time to either, or at least availability to to do any sort of streaming or recording or anything of it. It looked interesting to me. It's definitely kind of in my kind of game. Um, I just haven't had time. Now this is going to be the pain in the neck right here. It's getting... Well, actually, I'll just have to build over top of the lighters, I guess. Just have to do it like that. Uh... Devion and his uh, uh, streaming partner um, Hulk stream uh, Conan Exiles on, or have been streaming Conan Exiles on Mondays. Yeah, I think we have to go up another level here. Let's do a ladder to there. Get rid of that. Put a wall in here eventually. A wall in here now. Another scaffold across here. And I'm super horrible at catching them when they're actually live. Because that's me. So now I can build this down here. 300 hours, that'll. We can do another row there while we wait. Build, build, build. Dig, dig, dig. How the game works, everyone. Somebody's having breathing problems. Oh, new printables. I didn't hear the ding. Creativity, athletics, iron gut, gastrophobia. That's that's a good person for work. Um, we don't really need a doctor. We're playing on no sweat. Do we need somebody to do... That's an interesting... Cre well, actually, creativity is a good one to have other things with. Can I do cooking? Can I do building? But has increased machinery so they could do the operating but they can't do the machinery building maybe we just take the generic worker with the athletics that can move that can actually run faster than jake i think we will we'll take hassan we need a bed for hassan though uh which we don't really have like we get this room oh don't do that molly Let's get one of these emergency-like. Oh well, Hassan, you're gonna have to sleep on the floor for a night. I mean, these guys gotta hang upside down, so you can't complain too much. Meanwhile, we'll give Hassan... Oh, we have some other skill points to spend here. Uh, Ludarks, you can do plumbing, I think. Ren, you can have the second grilling, and Hassan, you can do Carrying, I think. <laughs> Grind man exiles. Can you just build these here some time? Sometime soon? You're gonna make me push, I'll push. There. 
I pushed. Now let's do those two while you're there. And those two there. I know you're trapped. We'll fix it. Or you'll fix it. Even better. Okay, so I think we can let this loose now. Got enough of a tank established here. We just need to poke those three spaces in there. Alright, Lieutenant, thanks for stopping by. Pull that out. That needs to go. Ooh. I think this stuff out. And those guys are flopping away there. Let them through, let them through, let them through. They want to go into the cesspool. Wait, the whole place is a cesspool already. Good. This then. There they go. Alright, I think we can poke a hole in this now. It's wet. It's water. There we go. Go there. It worked out pretty well. It's not a perfect system, but it works. And then we can do this as well here. Drain that little drop out. And this here as well. Okay. That went okay. Get rid of that. This isn't anywhere near the right level, but that's okay. Pull that out. Build some rooms. Do we have any more seeds yet? We do. Let's just, uh, actually, let's just take the whole thing and do a... <laughs> like that. Uh, this can come out like that, like this. Colony achievement earned. Uh-oh, we're out of sand. We're going to have to take some more sand up. To pay the bills, use a duplicate skill points to buy an entire branch. Yeah, well, that's easy to do when there's only two in a branch uh, for, for grilling. Uh, let's... Dig down, or dig over, or dig somewhere and get some sand. Yeah, let's dig those out like that. And then this needs to be here. Ah. I love the falling. Now we don't have a proper kitchen. We'll get there. I'm trying to clear out this area and it's tedious. And I don't even know what I'm going to do with this. I mean, I guess I could let it drop down into here. Is that the best thing to do with it? It probably is. Alright, let's do it. Go that way. I mean, this is going to give us... Bog buckets give us bog jelly. Bog jelly is just edible. I don't think it can be cooked into anything. Oh, actually it can. Swampy delights. Let's turn that on. Uh, let's go into the consumables here, by the way, and not let them eat the spiny grub fruit itself, bog jelly itself, the bristle berry itself, the grub fruit itself, Paku. Yeah. Drip, drip, drip. 
We're going to fill that bucket up. There's uh, Ren doing some cooking. Oh, we can't reach. That's why we can't get over there. Finish that dig. So this is full now. And so this is just not working because it's full. But that keeps our water supply full, which is really nice to have. Really nice. Work faster, work faster. Uh oh, we got salt water. How do we get salt water, Brian? No! Dang it. Shoot. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh man, that's a mess. Can I get any of it? Oh, I can. I can get some of it. If I catch it quick enough, I can I can get it without it uh, making a mess of itself. You're gonna make it a mess of yourself, Ashcan. Did you pee again? No, it's gonna be different this time. Travaldo this time. Where'd you pee at? You peed down the chute. All right. Fine. All right, let's see if this will cheese and let us get this brine out of here, even though it's too much to mop. Sometimes it'll let you do that. In the meantime, I guess I should put a lip on this. What the heck is that melting from? There we go. You up. Oh, it already is priority 8. Great, okay. Can we come up here and mop this now? Yes, we can. Alright, Dev. Catch you later. Thanks for stopping by. Eh. Too much liquid. Okay, can I cheese this then? I don't want salt water in my polluted water. Or brine in my polluted water. Okay, you can flip-flop your way over here. Take that out. Yeah, I'm glad I started capturing some of this polluted water up here. That could have been a mess. Hi, Manadwin. Uh, the DLC added this new starting biome for one, which is a swamp biome filled with things like polluted dirt and polluted mud and mud. Um, there's an awful lot of polluted water here. So I guess we could fire up a sieve, by the way, but I got this all germy, didn't I? Mm, yes. Pressure damage, too. Um, so that's, that's kind of the first part of the DLC. The second part is the, um, these transporters, which we haven't started using yet. I wanted to get to them today, but, uh, I want to have a couple more dupes first. Somebody peed in here. Who peed in there? Oh, that might have been where, um, what's his nose peed? Uh, Travaldo. Pre fruit preserve. Another digger. We might that might actually not be a bad idea to take Gossman. I'm fine with that. Yeah, let's take Gossman. Gossman, come in and go right to sleep. Gossman, you can have a skill point. Phasian can have another skill point. 
I really need to go that far? Yeah, because it'll give you more science points. Eris, you can have... Super hard digging. Jake, you can have improved construction. Travaldo can have improved carrying. Okay. Go into the priorities then. Nighttime's a good time to do this kind of thing. There. I forgot to give Hassan some jobs. Hassan was just like strength, yeah. So let's do those three also. Did I do this? No, let's change this to enable proximity. Pop those off of there. I think I'll let this bit down here fall into this pool down here, but I need to... I need to put a floor here first. Somebody come and build that. Looks like Jake's coming. Night time is the right time. And it broke. And it broke. Somebody build this wall, please. And this one. Where this one breaks, or one of those breaks. We're gonna cheese that salt, that brine out of there. I don't like it. I think we'll be okay to break into here now. And get that fluid water out. We have a bunch of idols, though. Why is there... Oh, that's why everyone's so idle. Uh, let's do this. And we need a wall here. I need to take one of these out. This out. Take that out. Let's see the numbers. There it is, right there. Oh, ceiling didn't collapse. Relax. Oh, Ludarks. Now they're going to fall. Whee! <laughs> I love it. They're so dumb. Okay, uh, come back down here. Yes, good. Take those two out, build this one. Priority nine. All of those three. Oh, that was annoying. Oh no, oh no, hurry, hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Good job, Fazian. Okay, now we can take those three out. Cramming a bunch of uh, salt water into a tile that I'm going to magically get rid of like that. Alright. So, that's good. I can do this now. I can do this now. That can go there, this can go here. And then this can go here. Am I okay with that? Yes-ish. But we're getting into the cold biome now. So maybe I should put some more insulated tiles, or do I want to keep digging down here? How low do I want to go? That is the question. That is the question that everyone must answer. How low can I go? I think there is okay, at least for now. Put some more insulated tiles in here. Should have done that originally. At least until I run out of igneous, which doesn't look like it'll be super duper soon. Actually, I think I will dig down here and get to this bog bucket first. And this mellow mallow. And then we'll get out of here. But then I'm going to let a bunch of crap fall down there. Well, I guess we'll have to clean it up. Sweep all that. And I want to plant some of the other plants, the 
uh, the spindly grub fruits, and those take the sulfur fertilization. So I, I'm gonna have to punch into this and get this polluted water down here, which means that I'm gonna wanna do a floor here to make sure that it goes this way. Uh, let's do a, put this stuff in here. Not strictly necessary, but necessary enough. Don't want anybody to get stuck down there. Good, and now we can punch into here, which I think I'm gonna have to do via creativity. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we'll go here. Dig that all out. Like this. We'll let it flow. Why can't we get up? Oh, that's why. Hydrogen here? Yeah. Uh, these guys fart out hydrogen, so it's got to collect somewhere. There we go. We'll have to vent it at some point, but... Or burn it at some point. Can we mop... Oh, yeah, can we mop this stuff and sweep this ice up? Although, I'm not properly storing ice right now. I should probably deal with that at some point. Yeah, use it for power. I agree. Take that out. Maybe I can put in uh, st storage right here that stores ice. These guys are fine with a thin layer of polluted water on them, so I'm going to leave it there until we're done. Although, I guess I shouldn't bother mopping that either. Until we're done. Should put in a bottle emptier here if I had room for it. I can go there. And we can make the thing. This will store uh, liquefiable ice. That's dangerous. That's real dangerous. Maybe I don't want to do that. And yes, I have everything being stored together right now. Until I get into other biomes where it matters. Sweep those. Bring them here. I'm going to do sweep only so that I can be careful and not take polluted water, or not polluted water, but um, infected water in those directions. Build those. Although that much hydrogen is not going to be that good for power, but the other option is to um, eventually move these guys into a special room where their hydrogen is captured better. Oh, you... Yeah. You dummy. Let's dig into here and pick up some of these spindly grub fruits. Because I want to. Plus, we'll get some sand out of the... have to deal with that before we dig into there too much. Build, build, dig, dig.
Guess I can let that come out. Uh, we need to dig that one out so that won't work. water there. Just from down here for cold storage? Like ice and stuff, you mean? I'm in uh, U.S. Eastern Time. So it's 10.30 at night for me right now. Oh, right, perishable food. Um, oh no. No, do not get your dummy selves stuck down here. Get out of there. Right, we'll build that one, and then we'll build this one last. In the meantime, that can push down into... Does food st stay fresh in the cold or only in carbon dioxide or chlorine? Oh, there's a new chlorine mechanic, too, in this game that I don't... I'm not happy with. Well, that's not the right words, but uh, chlorine now causes damage to the dupes. Um, I learned through experience. That's fine. That's fine. And somebody's stuck. Well, you can build your way out. Somebody can build you out. You'll be fine. I'll give them a priority just in case. There we go. Yeah, we know somebody's idle because they're trapped. Yeah, it's it, it makes... Oh, water got down here. Doggone it. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, it makes perfect sense, I agree. Did that get germy? No, it didn't. All the germs are down here. That's good. How did that water get down there? Ice? Ice melting? Probably. Oh, gone it. I think we can dig this out some more. Yeah, that much more. I don't know why that's saying it's unknown. Hopefully we can uncover it. Oh, we have another printable too. Uh, well, that's always useful. Um, strength, increase strength. Can it do researching? Just fine. Requires light to sleep. No, thank you. Because everyone else is pissed off about light and we're sharing bedrooms, so. Um. Do we really need another farmer? Actually, we do need a farmer. Let's take the farmer. Turner. Be a Luddite, that's fine. And I think I'm gonna build another bathroom. I think it's probably about time. Maybe we'll one over here. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Do I need more? To deal with more polluted dirt. I don't necessarily want to deal with all the polluted dirt, or do I? No, I don't want to deal with all of it because this also uses polluted dirt. Not that we don't have a lot. I'm sure we have a lot. This is also a new feature here, by the way. Uh, Manage when you were asking about new features here. Uh, it totally cleans up the, uh, the stuff here on the side. These, these diagnostics are really useful. And the resources only show the ones you pin as well as the ones that are new. Which is really, really nice. Because it was annoying the way that the thing worked before. Uh, what was I looking for? Polluted dirt. We only have 128 
129 tons of it. I'd say we're fine. Please mop that up before it gets to be too late. Shoot. Water right there. I do that. You don't need to mop up all the polluted water, though, Lux. Thank you. Uh huh. I can. Go into the liquid overlay. Yep, that's good. And then I can do this. Yeah, that's that's a derp in the game right there. Mop that. And I don't. So I think I'm. Gonna, I don't think I'm gonna compost anything else. So maybe I should have done this differently then. Do two of those there. Uh, flip there. Flip there. The fog that turns you inside out with one whiff. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, yes, that definitely is not good. Let's have Fazy and do some work. Well, not that he hasn't been doing any work all along, but. I think I'll do some more work. We need to do some more research. Now, let's see. This here. Boom. Boom. Might as well do these, even though... Kind of useless. Do that. Do this. Maybe we could just make the kitchen over here. What do you think? It also makes you sing show tunes. Yes. Yes, it does. That is true. Okay, so if we wanted to build a kitchen, uh, this would be the wall here, so maybe a space. Uh, we can put this... Oh, that is chlorine gas? Uh, let's see. We want a couple of... Let's see. A wall here, and then maybe a decoration. A couple of uh, fridges. A decoration. And then we'll put in... The, uh, this thingy here, and then a decoration, so this thingy goes here. Go with that. Uh, let's do a bit of this here. Oh dear. I've learned not to trust Kvazian's links. But that one's probably a reference to something important. Or something, at least. Actually, I haven't learned not to trust Kvazian's links. That's me being a jerk. Go ahead and grab that spindly grubfruit plant from there. So we can take this out now. Uh, this goes here, 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 there. Yeah, never. Uh-huh. I believe you. And let's do a airlock here. And that goes there. Rick rolled maybe. Uh huh. Did we get all the water? Yes, we did. Okay. More friggin' water here. Duck on it. Must be ice melting there. We should be picking up the ice from here, up to here, though. We need to do that. And so let's take this junk out now. Did 
we get all the dribbles? Nope, there's still a few there. Did we get all of this? Yes, we did. Alright, so I think we can open this back up again. And we'll jump up in there and get that stuff out. Research complete. Thank you for making the large sculpting blocks. That's what I wanted. Furniture, large sculpting block, granite. Boom. Boom. Uh, copy this to there. And delete this from there. Uh, you can go here. And we can put some more sculpting blocks in. Did we get somebody who could color? Decorating. No, we did not. Uh, Trivaldo's got a little bit of skill in it. We look at Trivaldo. And a new debuff, by the way. Yucky lungs. And they breathe polluted oxygen. Which is great. Uh, skills, that's what I wanted. If we gave, sort of giving him the creativity, we could have that. Look at Trivaldo. Yeah, we could give him the creativity next time it pops. Uh, Ashcan, you need to come this way. Ludarks, you can go here, I suppose. Hassan, you can go here. And Turner, I forgot to give you anything. You need to go into farming. We'll give you a farming hat. Uh, Ashcan can have the improved... No, the Critter Ranching 2 hat. You could say black band instead of a brown band. That one. And then this one. That one. Sweep that stuff up. Another thing that's changed. Bridges now have to be powered. No more cheesing a fridge into a um, into a, a cloud of carbon dioxide. Um, it doesn't work anymore. So don't try it. I should put a airflow tile here. Um, they fixed that bug, or whatever you want to call it. Can somebody reach that? Yes, they can. Ah, uh, Phasian. What's that? Oh, a bliss burst seed. Okay. So here, let's plant the spindly grub fruit. Copy settings. Zip. Printable.
Yeah. <laughs> uh, we don't really need a machinery person. I will just take this. But I think it might be time to come over here and engage the teleporters and see what's out there. Uh, but first, let's get some more sand. Because we're out of sand again. I mean, we can grind sedimentary rock or sandstone or any of that stuff into sand, but I'd rather not grind it if I don't have to. Put a ladder in right in here. What's that? Oh, it's been the grapefruit. Engage. Yep, as soon as... I don't find anything else to do. To take my time away from it. Build igneous tiles across here. These to there. Did that get done? Yeah. But it's not gonna let me delete these. Doggone it, game. Guess I'll have to try and go around and come, come at it from the other side. Oh, the hydrogen. Right, we're going to have to put a hydrogen something up here. Uh, trap for it. There's plenty of sand now. Okay, so who do we want to take or send or whatever to the new world? That is the question. Also, that is also a question. Do we want to cook? Uh, let's do this copy to there. So if you look now, I've put everything in here. No errands. They will not work unless they are powered. Which is a bit on the annoying side. Just a bit. Pick that up. And let's put these... Uh... Yeah, I think we need another one of these here anyway. We're overdrawing our power right now. Oh, well, we're not overdrawing it right now, but we're over... over... potentially. Hey, peps. Welcome. You're talking about oxygen, oxygen not included, not ever having gotten into it. It's definitely a game that takes a little bit of work to get into. Like, you can't just jump in and hope for the best. <laughs> well, you can, I suppose, but yeah, we definitely need to get rid of this hydrogen. Vent it out of here. But I, also, I also want them to mop this crap. Mop this crap. So who do we want to take to the new world? It needs to be somebody who can build and dig. Uh, Trivaldo. What are we going to give Trivaldo to do? Art. Coloring, yep. Uh, so Jake or Eris would be okay candidates. Faithy needs to stay here. But if I take Jake or Eris, I need to leave behind someone else who can dig or build. And right now, Gossman's the only one who has anything in digging. That means Eris is our candidate. We're going to the new world. Uh, how long until Gossman? Not too long. Okay, so Gossman will get into there. So I think Eris is our candidate for... Our, our uh, interspace travel here. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's a grapefruit plant. Interesting. Oh, spindly grapefruits are different than grapefruits. What's the difference? Grubfruit plant is tended by a divergent critter and produces high quality grub fruits. A spindly grub fruit plant produces spindly grub fruit. If it's tended by a divergent critter or produce high quality fruits instead. Oh, I see. Okay. And we're making 
Bindley Grubfruit here. And that's Grubfruit. Interesting. That... F Actually, we don't even need that anymore. No, we don't. Let's break this open, too. We'll build a ladder going up to continue our vertical ascent into madness. Okay, so Eris gets to go to Strange New Worlds. Uh, Eris. So, hop in and teleport. And a little email symbol, which I, I love. Okay, so Eris is now here. Uh, Eris is on this new world that we, we found the surface of in the last uh, stream, last time we played this. But there's a lot of stuff that we can, that's already kind of half built for us here, which is nice. Oh, the teleporter transmitter's right here, too. Oh, nice. That's really nice, because in my test world, I could I still haven't found it. So Eris can actually return to uh, um, Madini uh, anytime we want. Well, within reason. Uh, so we have a uh, cryo tank here, which we'll inspect. We see nothing of interest, which is asinine. But we can defrost Eris's friend here. And also, I want to I'll just go ahead and pause. Um, there's lots of stuff here. Eris has made an amazing discovery. A barely working cryo tank has been uncovered, containing a Lindsay duplicate inside a frozen state. Inside in a frozen state. Eris is successful in thawing Lindsay, and this encounter has filled both duplicates with a sense of hope. Something they will desperately need to keep their morale up when facing the dangers ahead. So we're almost to the edge here of the map. Let's dig across to this, because we have a bathroom here, which is nice. Let's build a couple of beds, maybe? Somewhere? Really? Alright, we're going to have to dig that up then. Uh, bed, bed, bed. Back to the bed. Build a couple of beds here, maybe? In the nicer room? And then we'll build a ladder. Uh, yeah. Ladder going up here to the bathroom. Before it's too late. We have a crisis on Mudini. Crops. Okay, well, that's not really a crisis. It'll be fine. Let's build this up a little bit more. Not that way. Correct way. A couple more of these things. This is going to be fun to get this water out of here. Oof. A lot of sand up there. That's good. What's this? This looks like a... There's a rock layer. Copper striations in igneous rock and dirt and mafic rock. Striations? Is that the right word? I don't know. I'm not a geologist. All right, so we have a bathroom, we have a transporter, we have a place we can put a ladder, we have a nosh sprout, which is this game's version of uh, soybeans, basically. Uh, there's a lot of ethanol here on this map, which is good if you like ethanol. This is also a very small map, because you can see we're already here in the oil biome. I don't know who's over there complaining about what. A slickster. Okay. There's also a spork kit here, so it's not great. Yeah. Yeah, the, yeah, the game's not uh, not too sh uh, certain about uh, how to define certain things. Redundant, I suppose. Let's put a ladder here. And we have an achievement earned. And that would be... Ghosts of Gravitas. Recover a database entry by inspecting facility ruins. I think we did that a million years ago, but thank you. Also, we could inspect that, which has nothing of interest. And then this is the same 
teleporter that we can send back to Marini with, which is nice. But I wanted to inspect it and tell me there's nothing of interest. And there's a bit of nutrient bars here, by the way. Not much in the way of food, but there's mealwood here, so we know how to deal with mealwood. There's also algae here, so we can make electricity uh, the old-fashioned way. I will probably set that up here. We can also burn the ethanol for electricity, which is good. There's water here, but there's plenty of water here, so it's already tanked up and ready to go. More ethanol, which means more electricity. Some hydroponic farms, let's figure out what we want to plant there. Dasha salt vine needs a chlorine atmosphere. Which is great, because chlorine is now caustic to the dupes. Bristle blossom, buried muck root. We probably want to dig those up, because those are edible. Waterweed. And yeah, we'll get up here and do the just coal generator and stuff. But we're near the surface. This isn't a very big asteroid either. Like, that's, that's the right edge. And that's the left edge. And that's the right bank. And that's the left bank. Okay, I'm going to stop now before I finish quoting uh, Robin Hood Men in Tights. So this is space, though, and then this is the oil biome already right here. So this is maybe not that close to that right here, but down here someplace is an oil biome. We have down here, Nosh, Nosh. Okay, uh, what, wait, do those get fed? Ah, those are irrigated with ethanol. Okay. They also need to be cold, though, so we have to be careful with that. Uh, although that is a cold biome, so that's good. So maybe we'll put them in here. And irrigate them with the ethanol that's hanging out. Uh, let's see. We could do the... Um, we don't have... We need to find some coal. There's there's bits of coal everywhere. Here. Here. So that's good. The chlorine can just stay the heck over there. Ah, here's our... Uh, here's our warp pipe input from this planet. We didn't even inspect the other ones yet, by the way. Uh, in the other planet. Or the other asteroid, I mean. There's plenty of copper here, which is good. I don't like that all the built the rooms are not built at the same height. That bothers me. Or the same levels. Like, this one and this one are at the same levels. Because there's four spaces in between. But then this big room here is off. It bothers me. Uh, because, but I, don't, I can't move it because I can't move the teleporters. Or the... Uh, Cryo tank. So. Arr. We can pick that. Let's see what uh, skills, by the way. Um, and it's not really good about sorting the people into where they actually are. Which is kind of annoying. Um, but that's how this kind of works sometimes. You can probably have some strength. It's not... Hey, Starissa. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's because of random. I know. Oh, your warp input's in the oil biome? Lovely. I've, I assume um, my other, my warp output is probably down there. We haven't seen it yet, so it's probably down there. In my test world, I have no idea where my teleporter transmitter is. I haven't seen it yet. And I've explored more there than I have here. So I have no idea. Probably down the oil biome on that one. So anything I'm going to do is I'm going to dig over here. I'm going to make a little bit of a um, ethanol tank in this area. Like this. And uh, like this. Breathe. Breathe. Okay, very breathable still up here, but of course the carbon dioxide's in chlorine. There's chlorine down here too. Is sinking in some natural gas as well. We have idle people on this side of the world, or on this world. Uh, let's let's get our way, make our way up here to explore these then. Give them something to do. Ah, random POIs. Dang it. Right, let's work our way up in a straight line. And yes, I know about the shift. I don't care about crops. Relax, crops. They'll give you sulfur eventually. Where's the other one at? Over here? That one's not going to be fun to get to. Um, 
It won't be horrible, but not fun. One, two, three, four. This is that level. That level. Two, three, four. Yeah. Here. Somebody's stuck. Oh, crap. Um, all are already... Uh, Lindsay has minor irritation on her face, and so does Eris, thanks to the chlorine. Lovely. Why is Eris not digging those out? Speaking of which, what is what are Lindsay's skills, since we don't know yet? Don't know yet, because we haven't gotten... It looks like cooking, and tinkering, and ranching. Quite the combination there, Lindsay. But good that you have some varied interests, I suppose. Once I uncover some coal, somebody's trapped. They're both trapped. I wonder if natural gas is also caustic now, too. Yeah, indeed. I don't see where it says chlorine's caustic. Which is annoying. And these, these two are both idle because they have nothing to do, so let's build a little bit of a temporary power setup here with a manual generator. A... Jumbo battery and an uh, oxygen diffuser. Not in the middle of the air. Yeah, peps, definitely. It's definitely a uh, problem there. We're going to dig out some of this. Some of this stuff here. Go that far. More water up there. There's all kinds of water here. But this oxalate's giving us oxygen right now, so this isn't super critical. Oh, good lord. Ren, you dummy. Can you dig it out yourself, or can you not? Just, just do it normal. Ren's got a sore back. It's fine. Did Ren just pee in the pool? Oh, gone it, Ren. That was my clean, germ-free water. Well, now I might as well just dump it down there. Uh, we have printable. Hmm. Well, that's a nice... Plus one agriculture, minus three agriculture. Yeah, you're garbage, Ada. That's good. At least this matches with that. Joshua would be okay. If we needed the operating or the husbandry. Uh, we don't really need ice either. It's going to reject. Good lord, we have we have more brine up here. What is it with you, game, and all the brine? Uh, let's also do this and this. Oopsie. Alright, and then, yeah, that one over there. We're gonna have to go inspect those yet. Are we 
Yeah, we can't activate them until we can get somebody in there to do it. The dupes have to do it. Why are you all idle? How did you get minor irritation? Do we have chlorine here now, too? I don't see any. Unless the natural gas or the hydrogen causes irritation. Could be the hydrogen. I don't know why you guys are idle. Oh, because you can't reach up there. That's why you're idle. Okay. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I did see of it. Yeah, I didn't get to watch any of it because of Thanksgiving and stuff like that. But I did see of it. And that was... I saw that they were at around 40k too. Yeah, that's awesome. They're playing uh, RimWorld, right? Y'all are bored? Alright, let's find something for these two to do. Uh, they probably could plant some... Or pick the millwood? That'd be good. We could plant some. That would also be good. Put down some planter boxes. In my test game, there was a room with planter boxes. Ooh, what's down here? Sour gas. Oh, here it is. Here's our room with planter boxes. And it's raining ethanol right now. Because it is, oopsie, hotter than heck down there. Yeah, everything's getting broken. Talk on it. Food. Farm tiles. Get a those random points of interest. Hopefully they improve some of the logic on those, by the way. Yeah, I saw that uh, Zelly had to eat a uh, raw potato. I mean, again, I saw of it. I think I saw the the clip or whatever of it. Go here. Oh, is there a bedroom too? Oh, actually, I think I did know that. Chlorine trap there. Okay, can we plant some mealwood? Plant, copy settings, go. Who's complaining about what? Idleness? Yeah, I'm not surprised. Can I capture some of that brine? Okay. You're complaining about the crops. Really, game? Alright. Speaking of which, let's do that. And let's check on... Looks like... Oh, uh, that's why they need more work. They need more uh, storage to have more work to do. There you go. Now you got some work to do. Hi, Ed Together. Welcome. Thanks for the follow. Too much liquid, but I caught three of the tiles in time. What's uh, what's that, Sir Stroming? However, it's pronounced. I forget what that is. Is that the the fish? Are you two record? Hey, Caladorn. Sneaking around here. Welcome. Alright, don't stand in the chlorine and stuff, guys. Don't be dumb. Uh, let's see, what do I want them to work on next here? We have that. We probably need something to cook with. Uh, once we have that, I should say. So let's build a... Um, Microbe musher.
Well, I was talking about it because Peps brought it up. Yes, it's toxic smelly. Yeah, toxic smelly fish. Yeah. Is that the is that the Swedish one? Because uh, the the Norwegian one is lutefisk, right? Or is, or is that the um, Icelandic one? I can never remember. <laughs> Rotten, rancid, dead. Well, it is dead. I mean, most of us do eat. Okay, it's it's the Swedish one. Okay, most of us do eat dead f dead. Uh, our food is mostly dead when we eat it. I mean, most of the time. Oh, the coal, good idea on the coal generator. Although I don't think I have any coal for them to... Oh, I do, actually. They did fill it, and they... Yep, okay. Thank you for the, for the reminder on that one. <sighs> Are you complaining about idleness again? Yeah. Alright, I need to find them some more work to do. Your gawk is always gawk is always fresh. Yeah, uh, I'm not surprised, Peps, that at all in that in that case. <laughs> Smells like it's decomposing. Okay, that'll go there. This still needs to be mopped, and we still can't get those two stupid blocks. Talk on it. Back here we go, and. We probably should put some storage in here as well, then. Uh, we'll make these out of sandstone, I think. Dig away, build away. I haven't gotten far enough for the... What, what am I supposed to shut up about? The, the, the smelly uh, Norwegian version of that? Um, I haven't gotten to the rocket mechanics. No, I've I barely made it f further. I haven't made it much further on my test world as as we made it here. I just basically started it up just to see what was going on, so I had a grasp of of this before I started the stream uh, on Tuesday, and then on um, and then yesterday I fired it up again just to make sure that the game wasn't still broken. So let's go ahead and put everything in here for now too. And then uh, we'll move on from there when we have time and stuff. That gives them something to do as well. It's just always a good idea. And you can build that there as well. They changed some of the um, some of the tile art too. Like I think phosphorite's a little bit different than it used to be. I'm I'm out anyway. It, it, I'm not that big of a fan of fish to begin with, and so um, yeah, yeah. I don't think I want fish flavored Jello either. Uh, that's just me. I'm, I might be weird. Um. We need more sand. I can just mess out. We'll get a ceiling cave in alert, but that'll be fine. Alright, so can I push this or mop it or something it? Yep, there's Kaladorn lying again. Now let's uh, activate this, by the way. And then... Build a ladder here. About this far down. Oops. Missed a spot. Ah, 
I, I blame peps. That's that's all I can say about that. I blame peps. Okay, I think I take this out now. They don't have to use that anymore. Nope, that's not what I wanted. That's not at all what I wanted, game. Let's pop this stuff out of here. I'm just going to drain all this junk down to the bottom. Rotten fish is heresy? Well, that's one I'll have to agree with you on. Yeah, we got the ceiling collapse, as expected. Well, stop crawling down into the chlorine, then. We're going to have to get rid of the chlorine somehow. Let's get rid of that block, maybe, or not. Let's dig, let's build a ladder here, then. You are not. Would you like to be? We have several duplicates to choose from. Um, and we also might take another one here. Give me a minute and I will switch over to that screen. And Peps isn't in here either, are you, Peps? Where are you? Now, I'm, this time I'm taking people who are active in chat. So anyone who is active in chat is eligible for a... That would be good for Caladorn. Oh, almost, almost Caladina there too. Look at that. Um, I think. <laughs> I don't. I don't like any of these either. I'll take the dirt. So let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's go here. Uh, let's see. Jake has another skill point he can spend on, and eh, maybe nothing. Eris, on the other hand has a lot of skill points, or has a skill point she can spend, and she has a lot of buffer right now. Um, given where you're at, maybe some construction would be good. Turner can go over here. Lindsay. Hmm. Maybe there. So we have, uh, let's see, we have Ashcan. Who is our resident uh, rancher? Uh, we have Ren, who is our cook. That's a good task for Caladorn. Uh, Trivaldo is our sort of artist, but also has some other skills here, too. Uh, Hassan is a general purpose loader carrier person. <laughs> Caladorn contributing to global warming. Uh, Gossman, who is a digger. Turner is a farmer. And Lindsay is a griller, rancher, tinkerer. Uh, so Peps or Caladorn or Add Together. Uh, if you would like to select a duplicate that you would like to become, uh, I'll it out or chat it out or whatever. Well, Phasian's already the researcher, so that's out. But uh, you could be Ren. Let's uh, go here then. That's not what I wanted. Where is it? Oh, that's why. It's covered up. Traits. Let's see. Uh, you are... Flagellant, so that's perfect. Uh, uncultured. You have a green thumb, even though you're not, we're not using you for agriculture right now. You are a stress vomiter, but you are a balloon artist when you're overjoyed. Uh, you have skills thusly with heavy cuisine skill because, well, that's your job. Uh, you are, you have two germ resistance. You've had a bunch of, yeah, you've had a bunch of exposure to Everybody's have exposure to food poisoning. It's kind of the status of the game at this point. Okay, so we'll make this one Melodorn. A good cook that eats a lot would fit you. 
Oh, Kaladarn took the cook, so, uh... You know what I didn't do? I didn't do any scheduling here. Do we have anybody who... Yeah, no. But we could do a second shift. And split some of these folks up. Uh, let's see. Lindsay and Eris are on the other planet. So they're less critical at this point. I'm just going to move a couple of people here into this one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, wait. That's fine. Let's put Ashcan back for a shift. Uh, because that's four and five on this planet. And what's going on over here? Breathability? Yeah, well. That happens. Uh, let's see. Let's build our way up this way. Work on it. But I don't want to let that water out. So I have to be careful. I think that'll be okay, though. Expect lots of kitchen, lots of kitchen accents. Uh, let's see. Well, Peps didn't pick one, I don't think. Nope. So let's see who we have left. Uh, there is Ashkin, who is the rancher. Rivaldo, who is uh, supplying and operating, who likes supplying and operating, but also does art. Uh, Hassan is general purpose. Doesn't like anything but uh, exosuit. Oh, there's some WIP skills out here, too. I didn't even scroll out there to see. Uh, Gossman, who is a digger. Turner, who is a farmer. And Lindsay, who is a cook, rancher, and tinkerer. No, no forklift drivers, but I, I guess uh, that would be Hassan, if anyone, because Hassan has carrying and tidying, or supplying and tidying. So that would be the most apt there. And uh, Teasy Girl, if you'd like to pick a duplicate out too, you can. Add together once Trivaldo, okay. Oh, come on, game. Alright. Why are you not showing me the, the pop-up window? Did I click the wrong button? Yeah, I did. Okay, that's why. <laughs> Add together. Okay, we'll make uh, Peps be uh, Hassan, then. Or make Hassan be Peps, or whatever. I don't think I have an Ellie, no. Ellie's the blonde, right? Yeah, I don't see Ellie. Teasy Girl would like to be Lindsay? Okay. I can find Lindsay a lot easier than... Uh, I thought we could. Why don't I see Lindsay? Oh, there she is. Why is it not? That's weird. Never mind. Never mind. I'm being derpy now. What are you face palming? Me being derpy, Calendar? Stop it with the... Oh, oxygen issues. Eh. It's still good. It's just you're down here into the stuff you can't breathe. 
Maybe if I open this up, that would help vent some of that out. Yeah, we need to clean the toilet. Somebody clean that toilet out. Or not. You know, whichever. Oh, you did. Did you? Are you picking my nose with it? Here. Probably nothing. Stop making a mess. Jeez. Somebody's stuck on Marini. Yeah, Jake's stuck. And he's cold. Let me get up here and fix this, please. And he was just cured of hypothermia. Okay. Let's dig across there, then. Open this up. So that I can close it back up again. Mop that, please. Well, Kellen always does that. That's nothing new. Now what? Alright, so I wanted to build this stuff out here. Actually, I probably should have built the ladder here, not there. Let's do that instead. Wear that off down there. Will you stop it with the alerts for nothing? He's complaining about the crops. Keep building this wall up. We'll seal it off somewhere. Maybe we'll go up to here. One, two, three, four, up to there. Whoa, that's not a straight line, Wally. That's nowhere near a straight line. I think that'd be a good place to cut that site off. Uh. Yeah, because you're walking around in the chlorine all the time. We're going to have to do something about all that chlorine. <laughs> A magical cursed finger. It sounds like something Caledron would own. Did this get activated? It did. Okay. So, with these warp conduits, we can, once we activate both sides, which we haven't activated the other side yet, once we activate both sides, uh, we can send items, once we power this conveyor loader, we can load items into the conveyor loader and send items via that uh, to, the other, to the other asteroid. So, that's super nice. Rummage these here. Build those there. Oh, somebody gets a warm... Oh, somebody gets a snazzy suit. Who wants the snazzy suit? That's the real question. Would <laughs> the finger swim?
Okay, can we seal this off now? Or is somebody going to get st stuck on the outside? Oh, I don't want to seal that off, actually. Actually, I do. I want to break through here instead. Take this down and let that liquid come through. Oh, to use the chlorine? Yeah. I could. You're right. That would be bad, but I could. Aha. Uh -huh. I knew it. Sneaky, sneaky. Good thing I said it... Oh, I didn't set it to sweep only. Oopsie. Good thing I meant to set it to sweep only. I know, I'm making you work down here where you can't breathe. At least there's not that much chlorine down here. Much. So down here, I need to have a couple of things. Uh, one of those things is a more logical setup. I don't know why we have that either. Do that. That. Actually, we don't need those. Well, we'll keep them. Maybe we'll use them. Um, but let's put in a pump down here. And this can go like that. And we'll run some power down here then. And we'll use uh, we'll use this this bit of ethanol to start with to make uh, to to fertilizer to irrigate some nosh bean plant thingies that I haven't picked any yet, but we will. There's a couple. I thought I did pick one, but I guess I didn't. Or it rotted. Oopsie. Shriveled taste buds. I could use the chlorine to disinfect some water, too. I don't know. Any of these duplicates look good. Yeah, that's... That's ridiculously tempting. The only issue is the decreased construction, but it's only decreased. It's not... Uh, the opposite. Or the, the bad one. So, I might not be able to turn down Ruby. I won't. Uh, let's see. Ruby, you get this one. Clearly. Jake, we need to get your um, morale up a little bit. So I think we can dig all this junk out now. Put that floor tile in. I actually want the opening to be here. Not down there. And I'll build across... to there. Actually, I'll just do it like that. Go here, of course. And we activated the input. We haven't activated the output yet. So as soon as we get that activated, we'll be good to go. Delete that. Build this. Delete those. Yeah, they can start with with skills anywhere now, which is awesome. And a bit disturbing. If that's ice or whatever, that's why that's... Yeah, that's melting. We got water dripping down here from up here. 
Because of course we do. Alright, so this can be sealed up now. So I got the door here. Now let's put in airlock there just for uh, reasons. And let's activate this. Somebody come and do it. Turner's coming. So now we'll have the ability to receive items from the other world here and send items to the other world from here once we find the receiver in the other world. Uh, actually, we got to find them both, but or we got to activate them both, yeah. But, ah, uh, add together has earned a skill point. Also, Ludarks did too. Got doctoring skills. I think you're going to sit there for a while. Add together, you need to have uh, more art. And that's about it. Peps, let's see. We'll do carrying. <laughs> okay, let's switch back to Zolitol. Zoltiol? Xylitol? Something? I've also noticed what time it is. So we need to wrap up probably a few minutes ago. Uh, let's activate that. Drywall. And that's where we're going to actually probably end for today. So I wonder if there's anyone who is live. Who we can possibly raid in uh, Red Circuit. It looks like not. So we did some stuff. We didn't do all the stuff, but we did some stuff. So no one in Red Circuit is live. Let me close that image, actually, so it doesn't freak out everything next time I open it. Uh, anyone else alive that I know of? Nope. I think we'll raid someone at random. And... I'll raid this person. <laughs> I'm not raiding Clontown or AVAC. That would be like a sneeze for them. Yeah, TZ, all my stuff's on YouTube, so you can always catch it there. But I appreciate you popping by and chatting with us for a little bit. Yeah, I see AVAX Live with Action. I could 314 views, though, viewers, though. Although I'm sitting at third, which isn't too bad for me. But uh, we're going to raid uh, Wayne, who is the uh, second uh, largest current Oxygen Not Included stream. It looks like he might be playing... It's hard to say. Looks like he might be playing the, um, the, uh, uh, original, or like the, the release version, not this. Alright, TZ, have a good night. And, uh, everyone else, have a good night for that matter, too. Thank you guys for coming. We'll be back again tomorrow for co-op shenanigans, uh, as per usual on Sundays. And then, uh, I'll be back, uh, with probably Age of Empires again on Tuesday. So, uh, thank you guys for coming tonight, and I will see you all uh, next tomorrow. Bye for now.